Bentley Continental Convertible 2011 Review. How good does it look? The standard Bentley Continental GTC isn't exactly a shrinking violet, but the Super Sports is even more striking. The additional body styling is form-following function, but there's a mechanical beauty about it all, with vents feeding an additional 10% of air to the engine and brakes, and subtly flared wheel arches house the wheels which are further apart for improved handling. Larger exhaust hint at the improved performance and all chrome has a smoked finish to set the car apart further. What's the interior like? Bentleys almost always provide a sense of occasion, but the Super Sports convertible even more so. But aside from the extensive but judicious use of carbon fiber, there's little to suggest the car costs around £50,000 more than the standard Continental GTC. Lightweight carbon fiber front seats covered with quilted Alcantara are comfortable and the dials and instrumentation are elegant, save for the sat-nav which has a dated-looking screen. The steering wheel and gear lever are trimmed in soft-touch leather, and drilled alloy pedals evoke images of race cars from the 1930s. How practical is it? Roof up, the Continental Supersports works as a grand tourer with 370 liters of room accessed via an electrically operated bootlet. Roof down space reduces to 235 liters, which is just enough to squeeze in luggage for a weekend away. The carbon fiber sports seats are comfortable and supportive. The biggest bar to practicality is the car's size. It fills an average sized parking space and can be tricky to weave along twisting country lanes at speed. What's it like to drive? Bentley's engineers have managed to shed almost 100 kilograms from the standard car, but the Continental Supersports convertible still tips the scales at nearly 2.3 tons. Despite this, the car is surprisingly agile, particularly with the adjustable suspension in its sportiest setting, but drivers looking for a Porsche 911 GT3 rupees style stripped out racer will be disappointed. The steering remains luxury car light, but is direct and fast and can make a trip to the shops as entertaining as a blast through Monte Carlo. The steering is firmer than the standard car, still soaking up bumps, but significantly reducing body roll. As before, it is four-wheel drive and provides enormous grip. How powerful is it? With a 6-liter, W12 engine with two turbochargers, the Super Sports convertible's performance is epic. It'll reach 62 miles per hour in 3.9 seconds and achieve a 202 miles per hour maximum, which makes it one of the world's fastest four-seat convertibles. Acceleration is relentless, and the car feels as though it has almost limitless power, pressing the occupants as hard into the seats between rest to 40 miles per hour as it does from 60 to 70 miles per hour. Power is transmitted to all four wheels via a seven-speed automatic gearbox which has a sport setting as well as a pair of paddles behind the steering wheel. How much will it cost me? With a purchase price of more than £178,000, and an options list which can push the price in excess of £200,000, the Super Sports convertible represents a considerable investment. Bentley quotes an official average fuel consumption figure of 16.9 mpg, but our figures were nearer 12 mpg. CO2 emissions of 388 grams per kilometer means road tax costs are considerable, as are insurance premiums, but these figures are comparable with other cars of this type. The Supersports can run on any mix of petrol and bioethanol which reduces its environmental impact, if not its road tax rating. How reliable is it? Under Volkswagen's ownership, Bentley's reliability record has been impressive. It shares a significant amount of components with the Volkswagen Phaeton which gives mass market confidence. How safe is it? The sheer size of the Continental Supersports means the driver and passengers feel very safe and the brakes are the largest fitted to any production car. Four-wheel drive gives huge amounts of grip, while active safety equipment includes an advanced electronic stability program, eight airbags and traction control. How much equipment do I get? The price premium over the standard Continental GTC convertible is mainly justified by the car's go-faster equipment such as carbon ceramic brakes, 20-inch alloys and carbon fiber seats, all used to save weight. Other kit includes leather and alcantara upholstery, fully electric retracting roof, an automatically opening and closing tailgate, sat-nav, Bluetooth and a Breitling clock.